Did you know Captain Rex has the most unique clone armor in all of Star Wars? Here's why. Early in the war, Rex had very ordinary armor, albeit with a pauldron and command skirt. However, as the Republic moved to Phase 2 clone armor, Rex did something very unique and very different. Rather than simply adopting new armor, he actually welded together bits and pieces from his original Phase 1 armor and his new suit. Looking at his helmet, we see elements from his original armor, including his visor and his antenna, but also a new Phase 2 mouthpiece. On his torso, he incorporates the new Phase 2 bodysuit, but maintains his phase one chest armor. Again, note the weld lines. To my knowledge, Rex is the only clone who customized his armor to this degree, which, alongside other elements like the Jag Eye symbol, gives him easily the most unique armor in the Republic. But why did he do this? We've heard that the Phase 2 bodysuit of clones was more movable, but that Phase 1 armor offered better protection. He was most likely trying to get the best of both worlds. There were also probably elements he liked more of the Phase 1 helmet, including the visor that he wanted to maintain while also getting some of the benefits from Phase 2. 